Hello friends, once again I welcome you to my channel. In my last video, we have discussed some numericals on addressing mode. In this video also, we will be looking at some more numericals. Right? So, this type of numerical already we have seen. So, see what this numerical is. An instruction is kept at memory at address what? 400. And at 401, we have the address field. And it is value is given here in this. And some more memory locations values are given. And it is said that accumulator is holding 100 and one register 600, name is R600, is holding value 500. They are asking us and see the opcode of the instruction is to add the content of accumulator with an operand, right? So what is that operand that we need to find out? Accumulator content, we need to add to it. And accumulator initial value is 100, right? So, if the addressing mode is indirect, then what will be the answer? Indirect means it is memory indirect. So, this address field value represents what? Address of the EA. Address of the EA, not EA. So, at 600, we'll get some address. That address is your effective address. That means at this address, we are going to get your data. This is the address of the data, right? So, what they are asking us? Effective address. So, effective address will be 700 and content of accumulator will be what? Content of accumulator will be the previous content of accumulator addition with the value of the operand. So, value of the operand is content of 700 that is nothing but 900. So, 100 plus 900 it will be 1000. So, see indirect addressing mode value of the address field that is 600 square bracket that is 700. 700 is the address of your operand. So now that indirect addressing mode, your data will be at memory, wherever effective address is there. So 700 content is 900. Hence accumulator will be 900 plus 100. Why this 100? Previous content of accumulator. So it will be 1000. Done? This is very simple in fact, because already we have seen. The next one is register indirect. In case of register indirect, where is your address of the data? Inside one register. So here our register is R600. What is there inside R600? 500. So 500 will be your effective address. 500 will be effective address. At 500 we are getting 800. So 800 is my operand. With that we will be adding 100. Please do not add this 1000. Because each of these addressing modes will be independent for us. So previous content of accumulator was 100. With this 100, we are going to add the content of 500 location that is 800. So answer will be 900. See, register indirect content of the any register. So here it is R600. So it is 500. That is EA. Where is my data? At memory location 500. What is that? 800. 800 plus accumulator. So it will be 900. So result is 900. Right? So, this was a very simple as it is a kind of repetition, but it will give us a good practice. The next one more. So, see here, this is a sim a kind of similar to our gate question. See here, not exactly part of it. This code is given to us. What will be the value of offset? That will be there inside this instruction. First, I need to tell you, this is a conditional branch instruction. Meaning of this instruction is branch greater branch if the result of the previous instruction is greater than equal to sorry greater than zero branch on greater than zero so if the result of r1 means content of r1 is greater than zero then you are going to jump here you are going to jump here right so they are asking us what will be the value of offset that you are going to store in this part of the instruction for that, what we require? We require the address of each of our instruction. Our instruction starts at 1000. And each instruction is taking 4 bytes. They have given each instruction is of equal length. This is a given situation. So this is 1000. This instruction will be at what? 1004. Next will be at 1000. Sorry. So see, already I have written here. This instruction is at 1000. Next instruction at 4. Next is at 8. eight. This one will be at 12, 16, 20, 24. Can you tell me why this 24 is written? 
because by the time we execute this branch instruction conditional branch instruction pc will be already incremented to point to the next instruction in sequence that is 1024 so from this instruction where we need to go we need to jump to the level the local instruction which is labeled as level loop so here we need to jump right so from 1024 you need to jump to 1012 so how to find the answer this is my target address target address equal to sorry my target address is 1012 so target address equal to what address of the next instruction plus offset that is the formula for our uh, what is that relative mode so target equal to updated pc plus offset target is what 1012 updated value of pc is 1024 what is offset we need to find out so the offset value will be negative because you are going back so offset is minus 12 this one is easier right then we'll move to the next one this one is in fact very simple problem what they have given this one memory map is given what is memory map some addresses are given and the content of those memory locations are also given right then they are asking us what will be the sorry which of the following instruction will load 60 in the accumulator right load means it will load the value 60 in the accumulator so which instruction is the correct one so we need to see one by one load has 40 has 40 is what immediate operand that means 40 will be loaded into accumulator no we don't want we, what we want 60 to be loaded so it is not doing that next load 60 60 means what this is direct addressing mode so 60 means what the content 80 will be loaded into accumulator no this is also not correct then load within bracket 20 so within bracket 20 means what this is memory indirect addressing mode so at address 20 will get some another address that is 40 at 40 we get the value 60 this 60 will be loaded into accumulator which we want to draw so my option c is the correct option sorry my option c is the correct option we can see for load within bracket 40 also so within bracket 40 means what it is in direct mode so 40 is holding 60 at address 60 we have the value 80 we don't want to load 80 rather we want to load 60 so our option c is the correct option so this much is there in this video hope you have understood these numericals they are just giving a revision to our uh, previous numericals right thank you